Diane's in the house. Hi. Um, Hi. I'm a bit shy. Um, Can you be more centered to the camera? Um, uh, no, no, no. Okay. Yeah. All right. That all right? That way? That's perfect. Where are you, yeah. where are you calling from? Um, England. Okay. Wow. It um, must be past your bedtime. Yeah, it is. Um, I met a guy um, in October. Okay. I met him from a dating website, and okay. um, he told me um, straight from the off that he wanted a relationship. Okay. Um, he wanted to get to know me, and um, he said to me that if I play him, then he will walk. Okay. And I said to him that I don't do bed hopping. So if you bed hop, then I'm gone. So we okay. more or less laid our cards on the table. Okay. Um, and he we said met. That to you, though. He said that to you. Yeah. Oh, wow. It's usually the other way around. So, okay. Sounds good so far. So, um, yeah, um, we met, um, we spent um, the afternoon and evening together, walking, talking, getting to know each other. Okay. Um, we were on the phone continuous every day, um, calling each other, and he was an open book. Okay. Um, and I've been an open book, and it w was going really well. And then... Um, uh he was gonna come to stay with me how far apart did you two live we live about 50 miles 50 is five miles from each 50 other miles? 50 miles yeah it, it would take me about by the way, thank you for saying it in miles. Aren't you in kilometers over there? <laughs> oh, over here we do it in miles. I think over there in the States you do it in kilometers, and I don't no, no, know no, what no. We do miles. We do miles. I didn't know oh, that. Oh, okay. I didn't know okay. that. Um, so, yeah, it's about two hours, I think, a bus and a train to get to him. Okay. So, um Everything was going fine. He was going to come and stay with me in um, to see the new year okay. in with me. Okay. Um, but then his brother went into hospital. Okay. Um, he, uh, I didn't know his brother had gone into hospital. Okay. He was he was going to come to me. Okay. Um, and I was, I've kept messaging him because okay. to had see. Had you guys had sex at any point? No, we hadn't had sex. Okay. How many times um, were you physically face to face with one another? Um, video call, uh, all the time. No, no. How many face to face? We've only met, we, we've only met oh. once. Okay. Met once. Okay. Got it. Got it. Got it. So, so anyway, I didn't I didn't know his brother was in the hospital and okay. he was due to come to me. Okay. And he said to me, I will call you tomorrow. Okay. Then then that didn't happen. Okay. And so I was messaging him, Are you still coming? And okay. he said, I will call you later. So and this went on for two three days okay and in the end i think i got a bit dramatic with him and i i, okay. I left him a message and i said if you are done with me just say so have a bit of decency have a bit of decency and a bit of respect by just letting me know you're done with me because i thought he was mucking me about okay because i didn't i didn't know his brother was in the hospital okay then he tells me, he sent me one message, um, my brother's in the hospital, we're 
Um, we are all up here at present, all the family are at the hospital at present. He said, right. now, now is not the time for drama. I will reach out to you in the new year. Okay. So I gave him four weeks okay. of peace. I didn't message yeah. him four weeks. Okay. Um, then I messaged him last week. Okay. Um, and he said that he's just, it's just things are busy at the moment. Okay. Um, but he will reach out to me at some point. Okay. Diane, I'm going to now ask you, ask me a question. I have enough backstory. I'm thinking because I. No, 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 no. That's not a question. All right. Ask okay. Me a question. Okay. Don't um, tell me what you think. You're you're asking what I think. This isn't about what you think. Yeah, you're right. Okay. Jonathan Blank, say it to me. Because of the drama that I've caused, do you think he's done with me? Okay. So let me just to answer yes or no do you believe you caused drama yes or no yes okay i mean well let me be clear about this so you own that you had caused some drama yeah and okay. i okay. i did apologize to him okay so here's the thing first off a couple things you've only been physically once in front of each other all the video yeah. calls all the telephone calls, all the text messages. Yeah. Those don't count because people are lonely and they want attention. So those don't count. You've only been okay. physically in front of each other once in the last three months. You have 50 miles of distance between the two of you. And there has been some drama. Now, he did obviously have his brother in the hospital and he was emotionally occupied by that. Is he done with you? Uh, you know, it, does it really matter? Like, what am I, why, why, okay, obviously you would like to see him again, am I right? I would, yes. Okay, but don't you want to be with somebody who wants to be with you? Just say yes or no. Yes, I do. Okay, so if he doesn't want to be with you, you shouldn't then... care about, I mean, in other words, only give your attention to someone who wants to give you their attention. Yes, of course. Of course. So, so is this done? Most likely, most likely. But you know, okay. if I said a hundred percent, you're not going to believe me. But the problem is, okay. you're going to be like that movie, Dumb and Dumber. So you're saying I have a chance, right? There's, I mean, I can always. I just, yeah. I, no, but, the way I'm seeing it at the moment is, um, well, I'm thinking he, um. By the way, said, Escalar, uh, we have a quote post here that says you're blaming yourself because he gaslit you. Well, I, I want to address that comment by her because you have admitted you created drama. So, yeah. so it's hard to say if he – now, I suspect he created some drama as well by not being as articulate about what's going on, and this is where – um, this is a lot of miscommunication that happens yeah, when it people was. communicate via cyber. But I'm going to say this, and we're going to wrap up in a moment, okay, okay. Diane? Yeah. Rather than holding hope on this relationship, just be in your lane. There's, a, there's an expression, be in your lane. Live your life, be in your lane. If he wants to see you and you're interested in seeing him, then make a date to see each other. There's no need to do more telephone calls. There's no need to do more video dates. I, I highly doubt he's going to do it because men traditionally are rather lazy. Uh, they want you to come to them instead of them coming to you. Um, and so um, I, I would right now focus on yourself, not focus on, I mean, take him out of your consciousness and focus on your life, which you're most likely doing. I doubt it's going to turn around, but if it does turn around, have more serious conversation, but do it face to face because this virtual relationship will drag out for years and you're just wasting your time most likely. Okay, Diane? Okay, thank you. Okay, can I give you a big gigantic Jonathan Bear hug? 
You can. Thank you. Thank you. Big hugs to you. Thank you. Oops, sorry about that. So, folks, you know, what? With, with respects to Diane, this is some of the challenges. They spent a lot of time communicating through the phone, through a web conversations. They built a bit of rapport, which is fine. But ultimately, you have to have to build the deeper roots of trust has to be done face to face. It takes about 100 hours of face to face time just to build the first layer of trust and no trust was built. And so when she she was simply making a request for some connection, he was obviously, you know, um, avoiding it or not obviously avoiding. He was most likely avoiding it. And then she went into drama mode, which she openly admits she had done. He was creating some drama. These are actually, you know, now we're almost moved. We're into the realm of two children playing together and they're not doing a good job playing together. And that's what I sense is happening in this dynamic. So I hope she gets into her own lane, focuses on herself right now, because what he does is irrelevant. What matters most is what she does for herself. All right. I hope you do that, Diane. And big hugs to you, Diane. Ah. All right. I think this will be a great place to wrap up tonight. Uh, folks, if you have something to share, post a comment below. I'd love to hear your thoughts. I do my best to read them all in the first 24 hours. Uh, if you'd like to connect with me, or first off, if you like this video, please hit that like button. Please share this video. Please subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell as well. Also, if you want to connect with me, there's links below to schedule a discovery call with me to see if working with a coach is right for you. There's my group called Midlife Love Mastery. There's Instagram. There's the books I recommend. There's my dating vows all listed in the first comment. 